we want to find Lister's tubercle at the dorsal wrist, which is a really important skeletal or bony landmark, we can put our probe on the distal radius, follow down, and we're looking for that distinct bony ridge. And there it is in the middle of the screen. For some patients, it's, it's really obvious. For others, it's more subtle. But we then know from that landmark that we can go back to the distinct appearance of the second compartment with ECRB and ECRL. We go back to Lister's very nicely visible there and then we can drop one more little bit over towards the ulnar aspect and we can see that in that little dip we've got EPL and if I wiggle the thumb you can see EPL just wiggling away there in that little dip and if you come up proximal you'll see it merge across and if you come down a bit more distal you'll start to see it as it traverses then across the top of the second compartment and it comes back, flicks across and back into its little dip there adjacent to Lister's.